Hey YouTube, what's up and welcome back to tutorial number 28 and in this tutorial I'm just going to show you guys how to add tables to your website. So making a table actually requires quite a few different tags and they all have to be nested inside of each other correctly. So the first thing that you actually have to do when you want to make a table is open up your table tag and then you can end it off down here and inside here will go all of the content of our table but you can't just go ahead and start typing in random stuff over here because it's not gonna appear as a table you actually have to divide your table up even further so as you know tables consist of rows and columns and if you break down those columns and rows even further you get cells okay and this is actually what we use to make our website. We use rows and we use cells. So the first thing we can do is just go ahead and make a row. So that's how you make a row in HTML, just with a TR tag, which stands for table row. And inside our table row, we put in a special tag called table data. Okay, and that is what m makes up a cell in HTML. So, this right here, that is one cell. And inside the cell, we can probably just put like um, some random content. Like, okay, well, let's just go ahead and say row one, column one. And right now, it's not going to look very much like a table. So, we might as well just give it a little bit more, a few more cells. So now we have a table with one row and three cells or three columns and we might as well just go ahead and copy this so that we've got another row and that's row two. Awesome. Okay, so if we save this now and we go back to Firefox and we click refresh you can see we now have a table with two rows and three columns even though you can't really see it it's it's there okay if I highlight over it you can see now we have this is one uh, cell over here and that's another cell and obviously that's two rows and three columns so that's just how you make a table in HTML and obviously it would show up and look a lot better if you added this attribute so if you go to your opening table tag and you add in a tribute called border and you set this equal to one that means we'll have a one pixel border around everything on our table so if we go back here and we click refresh we now have a table table that's a lot easier to read and obviously a lot better looking just because we have a border around each of our cells so that's how you make a table in HTML guys and uh, don't forget to check out my next tutorial where we'll be doing a whole bunch of cool stuff so thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time I would appreciate it a lot if you guys really hit that subscribe button and also don't be afraid to comment like or share my videos it's really gonna help my channel grow so thanks very much and I'll see you guys next time